Hi everyone. In this video I show you running Linux from scratch our edition on real hardware. This uh, hardware architecture is Intel 686 32 bits. Let's start. System is power up. We have signal that post loaded correctly. Here our configuration. Here is a grab menu. This is our operating system, which compiled entirely from source code. Here we have uh, boot information, and now we have a boot pro a login prompt. Here we have one user. Its name is Rod. Boot. He has no password. Now we can check kernel, your name, okay. here is our kernel configuration, 4.18.5, not last, but uh, Use it in Linux from scratch 8.3. Here we have uh, debug information from USB controller. It not really doesn't matter. We can start lightweight X uh, development X desktop environment by typing uh, start x here we have also here we also have debug information it's uh, also doesn't matter it takes a few um, a lot of time system is slow here we have mouse cursor and panel desktop yes we have system loaded here we have CPU usage chart volume control time clocks and two buttons a lock screen and power off another side of panel we have see we can see a virtual desktop switch Knipi file manager and menu button here is our boot menu system is slow menu loaded also slow here we have no application except I'm sorry uh, file manager task manager and two terminal applications also we have image viewer Let's uh, st start um, LX terminal. It's better terminal application. Other terminal application can be used if you don't like LX terminal. 
system is low as you can see yes now it lo it's loaded we have no uh, applications by default uh, but previously we installed um, nano text editor yes we, we have we not defined file name and now we see new buffer welcome to nano okay we can type something to show that it works and type control z control x and 2x by default we can use vim as text editor it also works we type control z 2x also we have links 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 is a text based console browser here is our screen we have no internet connection but we have menu and have about information okay now we also can exit from this application yes to install uh, other application we can use our assistant named chimp chimpanzee so let's go to our uh, assistant directory where applications are located this directory is a root mnt um, slash pay packages to short time of entering part path names you can use tab so we can cut few chars and type enter all needed chars is typed automatically and next we can type we, sh we should type our release Cur current release is 0. Point one. Type and now we can see contents of directory. There is a lot of applications. To install any application, we can type just uh, cat name of command point sh. Uh, pipe bash this command send contents of file mcsh to the bash interpreter we type enter we have a message that uh, dependence is not found it will be installed automatically so we have a uh, dependence resolving at uh, this way we install at first our dependencies then application which we want to install it's save our time in dependence resolving so you just need to type the command of 
installing application which you want all dependencies will be resolved on automatically uh, compilation time takes a lot of time compilation process takes a lot of time on slow computers to improve performance you can use modern PC and uh, you, you can use multi-trading tasks of building uh, can be divided on multiple threads and uh, build time can reduce can be reduced significantly now we have system checks uh, here we have see we can see that the checks completed and compilation is started we can see that compilation is completed and uh, sorry compilation in process sorry in process and take can take long time so you can see Linux from scratch can help you uh, to build your own system and you can customize everything as you need thank you for watching